Hi people, welcome to Chess 24/7, and you are encountering another online chess blitz video. I am playing with white pieces, and we have Karo Khan. Let's go for King's Indian defense attack. Sorry, with white it's always attack, and with black pieces it's always defense. And I've recently discovered that uh, although King's Indian defense is is not played at the high level, but I think it has a rich history I would say the reason it's not played okay I'm, I'm uh, going to play f4 because I think I have now a pretty strong uh, center I guess and it won't be easy for my opponent to break it let's play knight f3 and get ready to castle c5 okay c3 and now this is some French structure on the queen side. Let's castle. And let's see what do we have now. Okay, queen b6. But now I have an additional defender that's a knight on b3, which is normally not available. Let's play a4 to avoid a4 from my opponent okay now but this knight is in a territory and he is if not in a good position that then but again he's influencing some of these squares if he's not in a good square but then also he's not in, in that bad situation he's situated quite well and okay knight b8 knight a6 is coming now but let's right now just connect my rooks and we'll think about this knight uh, in, in, in a couple of other moves so uh, okay uh, I have the c file open c file knight knight c5 is something I'm looking to so that I can dislocate this an A6 knight which is supporting the B4 knight and I have ample protection for the pawn and I uh, yeah let's let's do this because I need to get this knight out although it is only influencing two squares he is influencing three squares but two of them are in the hot spot right now but now knight to d4 is something I'm really looking forward and maybe knight to d6 will be a great asset for me but obviously he will uh, capture that thing yeah because that knight was prob problematic if left over there but now I am in on the on my opponent's seven, uh, seventh rank which is quite good but bishop to c6 has broken all the connections but uh, at least my rook is protected so the queen cannot really intervene and can attack my uh, rook so let's just attack his knight on b4 and I don't have any other choice apart from taking it but I am winning back my pawn now so let's see okay bishop and queen are over here on this right now let's protect a4 and uh, c6 also so let's see what do we have but now my a3 and uh, a and, and c are not protected anymore with that pawn move rook to a2 okay let's get the rook exchanged and let's see what do we have now okay let's I'm thinking to bring this bishop to f1 because this bishop is right now looking at this 
pawn which is protected by the bishop and which bishop is again protected by the b7 uh, pawn so it's not doing a whole lot on this diagonal so let's hit the rook okay so I'm now forced to take the queen and now my rook is quite passive it has to protect its own pawn so uh, just something I don't like in the end game but let's get this bishop and protect my rook okay let's get our king rolling too why bishop to a4 my rook is protected so this pawn is not in a pin so I think this is a yeah he designed good game good game let's revert e4 c6 d3 d5 knight d2 king's indian attack e6 g3 f5 f5 is something i have not seen in a while bishop g2 knight f6 e5 attacking knight knight f2 d7 d4 bishop e7 f4 i played because i wanted to have a pretty solid cent center black castles knight g2 f3 c5 c3 and on the queen side we have a french defense structure uh, that in the advanced variation but i have an additional defender defender on the queen side which is my knight on b3 a4 and i think i should have taken it there with with my b3 or with my f3 knight taking with the pawn now weakens b4 which my opponent sees and grabs the opportunity but i think i was able to uh, overcome uh, his his knight uh, with my knight maneuver although uh, none of us was really able to capitalize on our knight which was placed in our opponent's position and knight rook a2 rook f2 check rook a6 rook d1 and yeah i was forced to take the queen this is something i really don't like defending my own pawn in the end game and I think rook bishop a4 is a mistake because he thought that my rook is unprotected on b1 and after I I, I took on a4 he was thinking that he could really take my rook and would be winning this game but he didn't see that my bishop on d3 is protecting my rook so bishop takes rook would happen but good game I hope you enjoyed this video and if you did then please hit that like button and subscribe to my channel for other chess videos see you in my next video till then take care tada goodbye good day